Hey guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 44 of Tropical Rouge Pretty Gear. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I literally just froze, but it's okay. Hmm? Why is Microsoft Edge opening for me? I can't even close Microsoft Edge now. There we go. Hmm. Yeah. Well, we all about to find out now. I hate the fact that this is ending in a couple of weeks. It's only the 17th, aka my first day of work, but by the time y'all see this, I'll be on my second day. Um, I still can't believe we're already almost done with the show. Like, we only really have, I think, two more episodes with this show, and then we move on to Delicious Party, because Delicious Party starts the first week or the first or second week of february and such and i really thought that this would have ended with 48 episodes and they're ending up with like 46 46 or 47 i don't remember because i, I saw something over the weekend and then like i wasn't i was glaring at it or no glancing at it for like a moment and the next you know i was like trying to do some other things and i was like okay okay See, the thing that has to be the most important to the witch is, of course, um, the legendary cure and how they were friends. That's why, once again, it feels like the butler is more like the true villain, quote unquote, and she is like the secondary <laughs> <laughs> well it's like she cares for her cause yeah that one episode when she was living in the haunted, the haunted school <laughs> and she was taking care of her Mm-hmm. 
destroying the world. And so the legendary pretty care took care of her. Mm. 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 I mean, because that's the right thing you're supposed to do. Exactly. Yeah. Oh. It's very similar to a wedding ring in a way. Bite. Mm hmm. I mean, but the way it's placed on her finger, it's not exactly the wedding ring because this is the wedding ring right here and then your pinky. Oh. But it seems like it is the way the flower was placed, like almost a marriage proposal. <laughs> even after someone helped her where she was able to look at the human world a completely different way she still just destroyed it See, pretty though. I mean, I wish we kind of got to see like a longer transformation, but she's pretty. I like it. In a way, I kind of wish this episode was really more like the 20 or 30 minute mark. And because so, th this is how kind of how uh, somebody said this over the weekend, how they feel about like the pretty cure finale episodes where by like the last few episodes that is when we get like the most detailed information on the backstory oh
And this is how it started. Ah! Never happened. And so he had to get frustrated with it and decided to take it in his own hands. And she delayed it for such a long time. Yeah, because she had to pass away so many years ago. True. Mm -hmm. oh. Well, at first you need to save yourselves and get the heck up out of here. Yeah, but where? Y'all gonna come in, like, her bedroom again and try to fight in there? Or are we gonna go outside of the castle and try to fight?
still, once again, too freaking easy, but, you know, it's okay. you do if you still care for her like you do even though you know this is why you kind of wish she still had that ring that flower ring that she you know got from her but no because she threw it away in the ocean it is gone yeah you have no one to blame but yourself we all postpone it. You know, we don't want to do it. Hell, the year that we've all had, 20, uh, COVID, <laughs> we all been postponing. You gonna tell me a hug, a, a hug or embrace or something. I needed that after the first day of work. <laughs> Aww. She literally became bubbles. Yes, yeah, so now what? Yeah, but what about everyone else?
Yep. Mm-hmm. I can't take it seriously. <laughs> oh! Okay, this for part one, really more a part two, because this is like a four or five part or finale. This part was pretty slow in a way, but then like towards the end after once Cure Oasis and the wish of, um, <laughs> our witch, our bad guy came together kind of picked up a little bit more but to know the truth like I said this is kind of why I wish something like this was featured early early on and such kind of almost very close to when like Laura became a cure or such and that was like between episodes 15 to like 20 to 30 and such but I mean, like, when you look at Hugato and how the story of Hugato went and how we got to learn really more important information very early on in the first half of the show, that by the second half of the show and really more of the finale in the last few weeks of the few weeks of the show that we had left with it, it was able to put the information that we knew several episodes ago back into it if you didn't remember and such. With this, it was like, okay, you're finally getting the story on these two. And so I kind of wish we got this a lot earlier instead of close to the end. I understand why they had to do it. It was still a good episode, but I kind of wish we had this earlier on. Just saying. Because then they could have recalled like, oh, hey, remember when we found out this? Oh, good afternoon. We getting closer and closer to just the last little bits with these girls. We got two more weeks. Two more weeks. But by Saturday, it's going to be like one more week. And it, it's going to feel weird because I'm guessing what they're probably going to do is, depending on what, what is the date of this weekend? The, it's the 20-something because, like, okay, so just, today is the 17th. Tomorrow's the 18th. The 19th is on Wednesday. So it has to be at least the 22nd or the 23rd by Saturday. I'm not 100% sure. I ain't going to know until I look at my phone. But it seems like with these last two episodes, they're going to really try to wrap this up, like, by next week. So that the final episode, episode 48, of course, is when Cure Precious makes her debut into um tropical rouge and then we're getting you know the ending of tropical rouge the girls growing up laura growing up then figuring out the problem of you know laura still remembering monitor and the rest of the girls and such and seeing them older coming together and then me crying like a little baby because i know i'm gonna freaking cry and then us moving into delicious party but yeah like that's all i really had to say about this episode really honestly it wasn't that bad it was still good but like i said this is something that i kind of wish we got earlier and such and this episode could have been like a non-stop battle like every single point up until you know hey cure oasis finally comes in you know, goes to the witch, remembers her, they move on as we saw that, and then the butler comes in as the quote-unquote true and final villain for next week's episode, indicating also the final, final episode when we get there a week after. But 
Other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 44 of Tropical Rouge Pretty Here. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially on Saturday, maybe even Sunday, depending on what time I get off of work and what time I'm able to get this out. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.